What really happens when we die? Most people think it's instant. The heart stops, the brain shuts down, and that's it. But what if the scariest part isn't death itself? What if it's what comes right after? According to recent studies in neuroscience and critical care, the human brain may remain active for up to seven minutes after clinical death. That means, even after your heart flatlines, your brain continues to generate activity in the very regions responsible for memory, awareness, and consciousness. In 2023, doctors monitoring patients in intensive care found something disturbing. In a few cases where patients were declared dead, EEG monitors picked up a final burst of organized brain waves, not random static, but patterns similar to high-level thinking, decision-making, and even dreaming. Now here's where it gets even weirder. Many near-death survivors have reported the same strange experience, floating above their own bodies, seeing a tunnel or reliving vivid memories from their past. Some neuroscientists believe in those final minutes, the brain may replay your entire life like a final movie reel, triggered by a massive release of neurotransmitters. But others argue something else entirely, that these patterns aren't just biological, they're evidence of consciousness continuing. Even after the body has stopped working, it's a theory that terrifies doctors and fascinates researchers. Does the mind die with the body or does it linger long enough to see what comes next? Seven minutes. That's all it takes to change what we think we know about death. You've been watching Unknown Investigator, where the edge of science meets the unknown.